Hello guys, how's it going? Hope everybody's good. Hope everybody's um, already uh, clicked that subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. Uh, my channel's um, My Cute is the name of it. Um, you're already on there, so excellent. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you also um, subscribe to me, follow me on uh, Instagram because I post pictures on there. Some pictures that I don't do uh, reviews on because, you know, some of them are older pieces before I was doing YouTube, so on and so forth. So, first of all, I want to say a massive, massive thank you to um, Cedric, otherwise known as OO, um, from Singapore. As you can see down here, he sent this from Singapore. Um, thank you very much, Cedric, for sending this to me. Um, it's a Singapore-only watch. I already unboxed it, and I already took out a load of bubble wrap because... I thought it was a big box and I wanted it to be as uh, quick as possible on the video and not too much uh, messing around. So here is the outer sleeve, which is a tiny bit dented, but it's just the outer sleeve. And here is the interior box. Let's spin it so it's the right way around. The box has G-Shock, um, the 30th logo on it. We just flip it upside down, G-Shock all over. That's it, there's no nothing else on the sides, all the sides are the same. Um, so we'll crack it open. There's two versions of this. There's um, Two different colour watches, one's um, blue with a dog tag, it's, uh, I think it's the DWU6900 MF, um, and this is the MF4, mirror finish. So let's just uh, see what we've got, we've got the, the usual manual, we've got the warranty card, stamped. On the 4th of December, Casio Singapore. Here we have. Um, I wanted to do this quite quite thorough because I'm not sure that there's been many reviews done on this, and I thought it would be a nice opportunity to show something that not many people have shown. So um, we'll go through everything. It might be uh, a longer one. So here we have the T-shirt that was included in the one I bought. So it's the um, DW6900, as you can see. It's exactly the same as a watch. Excellent. 30th anniversary, Singapore. So, again, Singapore release only. Um, is there anything else on the T-shirt? No, there's nothing. So, that's the T-shirt. There it is. Not too neatly. Let's pop that back in there. Won't be wearing it. It won't fit me. So, let's crack on with the watch. This is a watch I don't actually have. Um, so, it's nice to get a limited edition of a, uh, a standard watch. Um, we'll just... So before I go into the band, there you go, TW6900 MF4ER, um, and this isn't duck standard from here. You got your standard backlight, standard face, standard G button, standard bezel, and then if we go around to the bands, you can see it's not standard. It's um, you got pink lines across here. Um, you got they also come down here, look, as you can see. Just where my thumb is. You've got the gold that comes around this way. There we go, you've got pink and gold. Um, they're raised quite well. You've then, then got the glittery red band underneath for the Amira finish. It's quite a nice watch, actually. Um, it's nice to have something that's limited in a standard piece um, for relatively a lot, lot more money, really, um, compared to the RRP. So you get the limited watch with the set, with the um, T-shirt, with the in the full set for a little bit more than what the actual watch would be at full retail. So it's it's a nice way to do things. It's um, a cool set. Um, I do like it. Um, and yeah, there's not really loads to say about this because, you know, it's a standard watch um, it, with uh, a few bits of extra detail on the band, which is um, a cool detail. Um, I've seen quite a few pictures. There's also the blue version, which I believe is exactly the same detail. Um, but just in, I think, different colours, and you get a dog tag instead of a t-shirt. I fancied the red one, so I just went with it. So, thanks very much again, Cedric, for hooking me up with this piece. It's much appreciated. Um, he told me off earlier for saying thanks so many times, but, you know, when someone does you a massive favour, you want them to know how thankful you are. So, excellent. You know, um, it's nice in this community that we've got people all around the world helping people collect Gs, um, you know, sending them to each other, um, picking them up for each other, passing them on, trading, selling is excellent. It's an awesome um, movement to be in, and you know, hope everybody uh, feels the same about it as me. So, 
that's the uh, Singapore release Christmas 2013 edition of the MF4ER and I hope you all enjoyed my small review and thanks very much for watching and once again if you haven't please subscribe it means a lot thank you bye bye